Inspire Farm is a comprehensive solution for sheet metal farming simulation. It has the feasibility tab catering to product designers, quotation and costing engineers to assess the early farming feasibility and to estimate material cost. The trio tab is primarily for manufacturing engineers and process planners to perform detailed analysis of the stamping process. Let's get started by bringing in a CAD data of a sheet metal part. Parts come in as thin solids. We'll extract middle or outer surface for feasibility analysis using the extract phase tool. The tool help prepare the model for analysis by filling holes and notches on the edges as they are punched out after forming in a physical product. We choose material for analysis from the extensive material library in the product that includes SIE, European and Japanese standard. Orient tool estimates the best direction to stamp the part with minimal to no undercuts or negative draft. The user can also modify it. Press and tooling conditions that controls material flow and stamping can be added to feasibility analysis through blank holder and draw bead options in constraint tool. Model setup for feasibility analysis is complete. Run analysis starts the feasibility run followed by spring back. The run progress is shown live in the application. It takes up to a minute to complete the run. Feasibility run allows to visualize typical results like percentage thinning, formability based on forming limit curve, equivalent strain for evaluating any potential cost for failure during stamping of the part. Also, we can animate to see the flattening of the part to a flat blank. Springback analysis shows the deviation in the shape due to spring back after stamping. Model setup information and results from feasibility analysis can be published to a PDF report in a predefined layout. Flattened blank from feasibility analysis can be used to perform nesting analysis to study the material utilization and material cost incurred to manufacture the part. Inspire form allows to nest the blank as either single or multiple or as mirrored pair on a coil or on a sheet for traditional progressive and transfer day form. Additional material to compensate for missing addendum and binder can also be defined. Nesting results are available as report in HTML format. It lists a summary table of best possible layouts for each nesting pattern. Detailed report shows the exact position and orientation of the blank for each layout. These layouts are also exported in IGS and DXF file format to pass it on for downstream die design application. 